my goodness! Very nice, huh? Thank mm. you! Okay, so welcome to the first ever Shanghai Kid Vlog. I decided to start this vlog today because there happens to be a feast festival going on. It's basically a little food festival where chefs from famous restaurants all over the city come together and put up stalls and serve their food. I'm gonna be meeting some of my favorite chefs from the city today along with my foodie friends. And I hope you enjoy it! Look at the visibility! Man! What is that? Oh my goodness! Very nice, huh? Thank mm. you! So this is my friend Yannick and he just brought me some black truffles. Smell. What do you think? Oh! It's okay? Actually it smells like... It smells like a mushroom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not really. It's very, not very strong. Like, yeah. ah! And what? Well, yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, sure. That just uh, gives them more flavor, I guess. So I just got a black truffle gift, and immediately I dropped them on the ground. Yeah. Water? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So. I, I heard the. I heard the earth water. Oh yeah, they're gonna be there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They just get us. Actually, I don't. I don't think we need water today. Yeah, I don't I'll just get a small bottle. Yeah, yeah. Earth, right? Yeah, because of water. And it's our friend. Are we gonna wait for Rachel? No, she she said uh, she has a lot of things to do. Okay. Uh, she, she just She's Look at that. Look how big this thing is. Bread for the scale. So this is where we are going to, yeah, if Anna Batista, Beth Costco from uh, Alan Wong's. Me. Yeah, you're a star. Nah, thank you. Chef Julio from Tomatito. Hey. So what are you making for us today? Uh, well, we're making three dishes. Okay. One cold, two hot. Okay. First one hot is um, short ribs. Okay. Okay. Short ribs, wagyu short ribs with a chocolate sauce and vanilla mashed potato. Chef Brian from Hunter Gatherer Shanghai. How are you doing? Okay. We serve real food. Chef Carlos from El Epante. How are you doing? So we're doing it very Mediterranean. Uh, chicken skewer with harissa, lamb skewer with a uh, little bit of tzatziki, then vegetarian pizza. We have like marinated like aubergines, a little bit of onions, tomato, and then we're having cutfish and lobster filo triangles with homemade harissa yoli. Wow. There you go. Yum, yum, yum. Salad with a scallops botarga. Okay. So like uh, brine and smoked and dry scallops. Then we have a beach host from Canada, tacos with the chili lime sauce. And then we have the spicy Canadian clams with the spicy veg. And a dessert made of uh, vanilla ice cream. Ah, oh, my favorite chefs. <laughs> Hello. How are you? I'm good. I'm doing um, a vlog today. Oh, so, awesome. So this Great. is Chef Anna Batista, very famous chef in Shanghai and other parts of the world as well. I'm slowly trying to get into it. Where's the other one? How many tongs do you guys need over here? My goodness. I'm pretty woman. Besides one. Okay. Okay. Hey man, how are you? 
How are you? It's good to see you. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. The menu is changing <laughs> soon, so you can come back to Highline soon. Go back to your table. <laughs> yeah, like, you guys, like a month away. You managed to persuade you guys to join there full time. Every man has so, his so, price. So you, have, you guys are not going to consult anymore? No, not for a while. Yeah, not, I'm, we're pretty that, much right? off the market now. Okay. Yeah, we're going to stay there. It's a good home to have. That's true. That's true. I mean, it's taking think. something that's nothing and making it actually something. So we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it better than it is now. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Looking forward. Fred. Um, How are you? Good to see you. Sasha Kraut. Sasha Kraut. Yeah, I mean it could be it could be freezing cold, huh? Eh? Yes, and it's not. It's not. Yeah. Uh, this is Beth Cosgrove. Hey. Head chef Aloha. of Alan Wong, <laughs> Shanghai. There is the fun stiller. So fun fact: Tian Table is one Michelin star, and they're doing a food stall at a food festival today. Thank you. Beautiful. It looks a little bit hot, so we need to wait a bit. Just <laughs> fun. What is this one? Cutfish. Cutfish. We cook it to eat. Okay. There's a little bit of oil, of oil some, some herbs and spices, and we serve it with black quinoa. We have a red pepper coli and the semi-dried tomato. Very, very easy. Very easy, very light dish. Really like very fresh, clean flavors. Easy for you. We've got to try it now. Enjoy. The cod is soft, flavorful. Has a nice oily flavor, and then the, the pepper sauce is really. Good. Yeah, you know, you get the sweetness of the pepper. Also, some smokiness. Yeah, right, exactly. We, we roast the peppers. That's so we, we roast yeah. the peppers and give it this almost this chart outside. Sorry, this chart outside. Is the smokiness, huh? so, very good, very good. I love it. So this one is the codfish and lobster and filo pastry from Tomati Filo from uh, El Efante, I think Yes uh, El Efante That's uh, pita bread and blah 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 No! <laughs> okay. And that's my friend Rachel from City Weekend Hi! <laughs> Wait, wait. Mr. Fogra from Taiyan Table, courtesy of Stefan Stiller. Reopening in three weeks. It's good. It's good. That's seriously good. It's buttery. That's amazing. Color short rib from Alan Wong's. Another bite. We have coffee today. It's like for the first time in feast, we have coffee. That's nice. And it's not even expensive. Hello, Okay. So I'm here at feast uh, with uh, the owner of Ocean Grounds, Jimmy. And Ocean Grounds is like a new coffee place that just popped up in Shanghai a few months back. Yeah, and they're like doing very experimental <laughs> coffees, very cool stuff. Hi, my name is Jim Lee, uh, founder and CEO of Ocean Grounds Coffee. Uh, so we're at uh, the Feast uh, event in Shanghai, and this is our first pop-up in Shanghai. 
Um, so we're excited to be here. So Ocean Grounds is a concept started in San Diego, California uh, in 2009 by me. And then we brought it to China in 2011, our first store in Beijing. And now we have two stores in Shanghai. And we like to think we're the purveyors of the fourth wave of coffee. Um, so if you're in Shanghai or Beijing, pop into Ocean Grounds and try our awesome fourth wave coffees. <laughs> So what you just saw was the Black Beach Coffee by Ocean Grounds. Yeah, so that's uh, raw agave uh, infused into our espresso. We make a latte out of it and then fresh peppercorn crushed on top. So it's insane because it smells like a steak, but then it tastes delicious. <laughs> this is recording. Oh, yeah! Yay! 